Steven Spielberg expressed his opinion on the most significant project in his cinematic portfolio. It turned out that Spielberg has his own favorite Schindler's List. This movie about the mysterious figure of Oscar Schindler holds a special place in the director's heart, but he does not rule out the possibility of surpassing it. It's the best movie I've ever made. I can't say it's the best work I'll ever do, but at the moment it's the work I'm most proud of. The plot of the movie is about Oscar Schindler, a member of the Nazi party and a successful entrepreneur who saved more than 1,100 Jews during World War E. The main roles in the list were performed by Liam Neeson, Rafe Fiennes and Ben Kingsley. The picture was awarded seven Academy Awards including for directing and collected $322 million worldwide. Schindler's List remains the most serious and important movie in Spielberg's impressive oeuvre. Of course before 93 he had worked on more serious and profound dramas such as The Color Purple in 85 and Empire of the Sun in 87, but Schindler's List marked a change in audience expectations of the director. Films like Jaws, Indiana Jones and Jurassic Park firmly established Spielberg as the master of summer blockbuster entertainment films that are popular with audiences. Schindler's List doesn't fit that template. No wonder Schindler's List received rave reviews from critics. The movie brilliantly stars Liam Neeson as the real-life Oscar Schindler, as well as Rafe Fiennes and Ben Kingsley. Critic Roger Ebert notes that the movie Schindler's List is brilliantly acted, written, directed, and reviewed. Individual scenes are masterpieces of artistic direction, crowd control special effects cinematography. Schindler's List was released in 1993 and immediately won seven Oscars, including the award for Best Picture. The movie ranks high in various ratings, including sixth place on IMDb's list of the best movies of all time.